this tutorial on how to play float by Eden. We're in standard tuning. There's no capo. In this tutorial, we're going to look at the two main chord progressions and the picking that goes along with them. I'm going to start out here by teaching you the chords. If you already know these chords, you can go ahead and skip ahead. We have an A minor, a D minor. We have an F open chord, and a C chord, and then also a G chord. So if you know how to play those chords, you can go ahead and skip ahead. For now, I'll be teaching you them. So for a G chord, your ring fingers on the third fret of the high E, middle fingers on the third fret of the low E, and your index fingers on the second fret of this A string here, which is the second string down. You play all six strings. For an A minor chord, you have your index finger on the first fret of the B, middle finger is going to be on the second fret of the D string, ring fingers on the second fret of the G. And you play from the fifth string down here. To get to your C chord, you just move your ring finger all the way up to the third fret of the A string. So there's your C chord. To play an F open chord, we're going to move our middle finger down here to the second fret of the G string. Ring finger is going to stay up here on the third fret of the A, and your pinky is going to slide under on the third fret of the D. And finally, the last chord you need is a D minor. For a D minor, your index is on the first fret of the high E, middle finger is on the second fret of the G, ring finger is on the third fret of the B. And you can play from the D string down, so that's the third string down here. And there's your D minor chord. So now we can talk about the first progression here. The first progression goes like this. Two, three, four, C, F. So it goes D, two, three, four, C. Pick that note again on the B string. Move to your F position. Three, four. One more time. Okay, so that's how the first progression goes, and the second progression pretty much just builds on that. So the second progression goes like this. It goes D, 2, A minor, 4. Then we're going to go to our G position, G, C, F. So how I'm doing that, I'm going G, strumming through those strings there, putting my index finger over here on the first fret of the B, playing that note and then going immediately to my F position. Okay, one more time, nice and slowly here. So D minor, one, two, A minor, four, G, C, F, four. Okay. And one more time. That's all there is to it. So that progression is played throughout the entire song, and you can play along with it throughout the entire song. So that's going to be it for this tutorial. If you have questions, comment below. I'd really appreciate it if you would subscribe to my channel. I'm trying to hit a thousand subs before mid-February. Thanks for watching.